Okay, so we're going to do some bookkeeping. Um, this is really a TMA feedback summary. Uh, I've got on the board uh, a general ledger, a uh, general ledger bank account, van account, receivables, capital and payables, just showing the opening balances on those. And then there's the payables ledger, not part of the double entry, the receivables ledger, not part of the double entry. So in the receivables ledger, we've got some opening balances on three customer accounts, X, Y and Z. And we've got some opening balances on some suppliers' accounts, A, B, and C. And all I'm going to do is uh, a couple of um, credit sales, maybe, and a couple of, um, or one credit purchase and a cash purchase uh, with discount. So let's just go through those and we'll see how it maps out. Now, the reason I'm highlighting in this is because one or two of you weren't quite sure about uh, how the subsidiary ledgers work with the main ledger. So, I'll give you an example. The first example is we're going to do a credit sale of, let's say, I don't know, £600. Um, and so we'll set that up in the general ledger first. 